What an intense amount of backtracking that has just occurred by Blizzard in the most recent post on the forums. Kyvax talks about faster legendary cloak upgrades and ruins my video once more. So we're gonna we're gonna go ahead and make an update. I'm very I'm very happy to have to bring this update, but I'm also kind of uh, annoyed. But let's talk about why. Let's let's read it real quick. Read it together. Later today, we will apply a hotfix to the game that allows players who have upgraded the Legendary Cloak to rank 15 to purchase Malefic Cores from Mother for 2,000 Echoes of Nihilotha. This will be repeatable up until the maximum that you otherwise could have earned via Horrific Visions from Nizothic Ruptor. I suspect, this. I guess this isn't clarified 100%, um, but I suspect that this means like weekly Horrific Visions from Nizothic Ruptor. This means all the way up until what is the current cap. Uh, I, I suspect that that's what that means, not you're able to buy two for that week. That, that would just be uh, slightly silly. So I, I suspect that that's what that means. It's just like you're able to purchase all the way up to the current cap, which is 92 Corruption Resistance. The intent of Malefic Cores was to provide ongoing incremental weekly power gains to help overcome uh, remaining challenges in this final tier battle for Azeroth. I feel like it's done an okay job at that. This has been similar to past systems in Warlords of Draenor, upgrading the Legendary Rings via Archimon drops. Yep. And Legion, upgrading trinkets from Argus the Unmaker. Also correct. While each extra bit of corruption resistance only represents a very small increase in potential power, we understand the frustration uh, of feeling weeks behind, especially without any controlled way to close the gap faster. Precisely. I think this is actually exactly the point. With this hotfix, players can further supplement their progress through a wide variety of in-game content rewards uh, that feature Echoes of Nihilotha. It will still be possible to earn two Malefic Cores per week by fully clearing a horrific vision and or defeating the Zotha Corruptor on normal difficulty or higher. So, uh, honestly, they have fixed one of the major problems that I had currently with uh, the game and with the system, and I'm glad that you are able to now catch up quicker. Something that does seem a little bit rough is the fact that it requires 2,000 echoes, so what is effectively three, five, like three full clears of horrific visions uh, to be able to get one additional one additional uh, Malefic Core upgrade, uh, but in all honesty, this is not the worst possible scenario. Uh, I think 2,000 2, Echoes, while it is fairly steep, they have to give it to you at some currency value, so I am just down to accept it at what it is. I, I, think, it, I think it should probably be less. I think it should probably be like 1,500 Echoes, so two uh, full clears, but you know, in all honesty, uh, I guess I can just take what I can get. Congratulations to all of those who made posts on the forums. Congratulations to all those who made tweets at the devs. Um, watch my videos, support everything, retweet all my shit. I really appreciate it. Together, I would like to thank how, however incrementally small it may have been, we all worked together to make a change. All right, I will see you guys later. Check out my next video. Uh, whenever that comes out, I have yet to film it. I do not know what it's going to be about. So stay tuned for that. Like, comment, subscribe, and I will see you guys later.